In this video, I will show you how to dye your hair from black to blonde. It's a pretty much simple and short process, no stress involved. So if this is something you'd be interested in, keep watching. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time stopping by, you're welcome to the family. My name is Fatsima Ambali. If you're yet to subscribe to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button right now. Yeah, right now. I'm giving you five seconds to do that. I've been getting a lot of requests um, on how I dye my hair. Although my baba has been the one doing the cutting and the dyeing, but just to show you guys how it's been done, I decided to do this quick video for you all and I hope it helps someone out there because I know I've inspired quite a number of people and I want to inspire more people. You know you know you know for me i love my hair to be this short as you can see i really don't like it to be fuller than this because um for me it looks much better when it's this short and i this is like my trademark this cut is like my trademark i've not really explored short hairstyles i've not really explored I, I i'm hoping to like start exploring anyways um i would like you to note that once you dye your hair your hair texture will change and not that it will change for bad and your hair tends to like coil depending on the kind of, of hair you have but for me my hair if my hair is fuller than this and i dye my hair it tends to like curl a little bit but your hair texture changes basically it's becomes very soft that's the very first thing you should note the second thing i want you to note when you want to dye your hair is that you tend to have dry scalp yes because of the chemicals your scalp tends to like become very dry and sometimes it could be itchy especially if you don't moisturize your hair properly or oil your hair properly so the best bet is for you to always moisturize properly without further ado let's just dive right in here i have my mixing bowl i have my application <laughs> did i just say application spoon my application brush and i also have my developer this is a cream developer i don't know the name actually the name is here and i would also like to add that this is my first time i have not dyed my hair before my baba has been the one cutting and dyeing my hair for me i just decided to show you guys the process on how I achieve my blonde look so um, not to worry the process is very quick and simple as long as you can get your hands on the product you are good to go just you know once you cut your hair you can always do this yourself at home it's not stressful so uh, and these products you can get them at any beauty store yes any yeah any beauty store basically anywhere they sell hair products you can always get them and they are pretty much affordable um so unfortunately i won't be able to leave the products link in the description box because i didn't buy them online i just walked into the store and i got them so in my bowl i already have the powder the application powder i won't be using the whole of this developer i'll be using just half and mind you, the bottle is not full, so you have to be careful while mixing. I should also add that the chemical has an awful smell. God, very awful. You're gonna feel like you wanna choke. Make sure you don't apply too much developer. All right, so mix 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 you can see it's like pasty creamy and i don't know what i'm saying but you can see it's creamy just mix properly can you see just mix properly mix 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 so now so this is it it's not watery it's just Tasty. I don't know if that makes sense, but guys, can you see? This is the result, and this is just all you have to do, and you just have to start applying. 
Um, I really can't see. Oh, I think I need to do this in front of the mural. But this is just a physical. And be sure when you're applying it, don't apply to uh, the line, don't apply on the line so especially if you've had your hair cut already. You know what guys, I think I'll have to come back because I need the mirror to do this. Alright guys, so I am back. As you can see, like the hair color is changing already. Guys, can you see? <laughs> And you can see my hair is beginning to coil. My hair color is changing already, guys. Can you see how beautiful this is beginning to look? Oops. I just hope I didn't miss this line. I just went round like that. So, and don't forget, after applying dial, be sure to like, you know, move your brush so that the, so the cream would sink into your scalp and in between your hair so it doesn't have you don't have two colors so i can actually decide to go and wash the hair now since the hair color is changing already as you can see it's starting to go you know to be blonde however you can leave it to sit or to dry up so you can get the a very bright color depending on how sharp you want the hair color to be so if you don't want it to be so bright or so sharp you can wash it like um, 10 to 15 minutes after applying the the dye and you can even see from me I didn't even finish I didn't finish the whole dye I still have a little left and if you want you can apply it if you don't want it to waste <laughs> You can apply it to your hair again but i'm not really sure if i want my hair color to be very very sharp owing to the fact that my hair isn't so full and don't forget apply it to your teddy as well yeah i'm trying to look at the mirror so i don't <laughs> that's if you want your teddy to be gold make sure you apply it to it <laughs> All right, and that's it. So, this is it, guys. My hair color is changing already. Already. <laughs> you guys can tell it's going to look very, very beautiful, right? Right? So, this is pretty much how I dye my hair from black to blonde. And guys, like I mentioned earlier, this is my first time. Yeah. My brother does the whole process. He cuts my hair and I and that is it. But I decided to try it so I can show you all how I achieve my blonde look. So as you can see, it's pretty much easy, cost effective, and not such a long process. So guys, can you see this? Can you see this guys? Just be sure to make the products go in so the dye isn't just on at the top you know it'll be short to like use the brush over it all over again and don't forget the back side don't forget the back side can you see guys if you're low cut and you want to dye your hair from black to blonde or from whatever color to blonde this video is definitely for you if you're still here don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like the video it means so much to me guys and if this process is easy for you don't forget to drop a comment yep drop a comment normally i do not wash my hair every day even though i am on short hair so i don't wash up all the oil i have on my hair so I think it's time to wash my hair now. So I'll be doing that off camera. A few moments later. So this is the finished look again, guys. Isn't this beautiful? <laughs> if I'd left it longer, the color would definitely be brighter than this. 
definitely so like i mentioned the other time the long the longer you wait the brighter the color would be and um that's pretty much all about the dyeing of your hair i'll be dropping the step by step process in the description box below so you can check it out if you are kind of like confused with the video but be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe to my channel so you can be seeing more of this.